Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and this is part two of a velvet dress. Yes. Now I have some appliques that I had laying around the house. Oh, by the way, if you guys hear some noise in the background, that is Denim playing with his ball. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. But this is an applique that I got from High Trimming. It comes in 19 pieces, and the reason why I like using this piece is because they can be cut in small pieces, medium pieces, to large pieces. Now here's an example of what I mean. When you cut one piece, then you can cut another piece, and you can place it anywhere you like on your garment. Now, I like using the, the, the larger size needles when it comes to hand sewing, and again, I'm using the color closest to hand sew that matches the dress. So again, I am taking my thread and placing it in the large needle, and again, be smart, tie a knot at the end of your thread. Now I'm going to be sewing the bottom of the waist, the shoulders, and the sleeve. Next, I'm taking my needle, I'm putting it in the fabric, I'm putting it through the applique, and again, there's a knot there, so it won't go through. I'm putting the needle through the fabric, through the applique, tying a knot, and pulling it. So when you guys are actually sewing your appliques, make sure that your thread is secure so that when your client is wearing the garment, it won't fall apart or come out. Next, when it comes to an applique like this, make sure you guys remove the pins from the actual mannequin and pin the applique to the fabric. That way, you guys can get a hand of the fabric and what you're sewing and so that you have more control of what you're sewing. Next, again, I'm following the same steps in the fabric, in the applique, and out. In the fabric, in the applique, and I'm tying a knot to secure the applique. Okay? Very simple. And again, I Snapchat, I TikTok, I do everything. So when you guys are actually doing your work, make sure you guys record everything as well. Next, I'm just cutting out the appliques. I could have definitely used my wood burner, but right now I just didn't want to. And as you guys can see, I'm just pinning my appliques down and that's it. And everything is done. Next, I'm going to take, this is optional as well. Next, I'm taking my uh, stone pack. Of course, we're using an E6000 glue, my favorite, and I'm using this um, top here from your kitchen. Um, I like to put my stones in here because I can see my stones better and everything stays in place. See? Everything stays in place. Next, these are the trims that I'm using, the stones from High Trimming. These are iridescent in a size 30, and I apply my stones with a regular Dollar Tree tweezer. <laughs> Next, I have my stone and my tweezer, and I'm gluing down my stones. Placing them anywhere that I like on the dress. This is also optional. Literally anywhere the dress. I have no idea. Next, I'm taking a piece of plastic. Make sure it's not like a plastic bag, but something that can come off very easily. I'm going to go ahead and pin down my dress so nothing won't move. So that my stone's going to be applied carefully and easy with no uh, fabric bubbles, I guess. And also when you're doing this part, make sure your stones aren't moving or sliding down. After you're done, I'm going to go ahead and remove my plastic. This does happen sometimes, so don't worry. Just pull easily and everything should come off fine. Simple. And as you guys can see, the stones came out really cute. I didn't want to add too much. And I'm saving that bag for later on because I'm going to need that. And I am done putting down my dress form. The dress looks amazing and I am done. Also, make sure, make sure you guys stay tuned to the end of the video because there is a picture of my client rocking this dress. Also, the zipper is in there. This dress is cute, honey. You know, she is lucky I didn't want this dress for myself. But thank you for watching part two of this velvet dress. It is super cute. Follow me on Instagram to see my client. And boom, there she is giving me body, giving me fashion. This color looks amazing on her skin. See you guys next time. Mwah.